Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Zaire and I'm back with another video. So today I'm going to be doing a video about my lip fillers. That's right, I have lip fillers and today I'm going to share my experience with you guys. Um, I've gotten a lot of questions about lip fillers and what to expect and everything that comes with it so I figured I would do this video just to kind of let you guys know what my experience was. So without further ado, let's go ahead and jump into the video. Okay, so I got my lip filler done a little bit over a month ago now. Um, as you guys can see, that's how they look after a little bit over a month ago. <laughs> I'm going to insert pictures of how they looked with like when I very, very first got them done and all that jazz. But we're going to jump into the video. So I decided to get lip fillers because I've always wanted them, honestly. But for the past, like, maybe, like, two and a half years, I wanted lip fillers just a little bit in my top lip um, because I've always had smaller lips growing up. I always have. I used to get teased by my family and said I had white girl lips because my family has very full lips, and I don't know where I got mine from, but <laughs> I did not have very full lips. I'm going to try to do a before and after for you guys so you can see what my lips looked like before and after. So um, my lash extension lady, she actually does lip fillers and like Botox and stuff like that. So while I was getting my lashes done, I was like, you know what, let's go ahead and do some filler today. I want to do it. Why not? So the very first step that they do is they numb your lips um, and you have to sit there for about 15 minutes for your lips to numb all the way. Um, it's so funny because when I got them done, <laughs> I'm like drooling because I can't feel my mouth. <laughs> so you can't feel your lips at all. But the question I get the most is, does it hurt? Yes. <laughs> Even though you're numbed, you can still feel that shit. <laughs> and she numbed me really well. I sat there for like 15, 20 minutes. Like, she numbed me really well. I just like... I could still feel it because you can feel a needle like going in your skin, you know, you feel it a little bit at least. So they put the lip stuff on you so your lips numb and then you lay down or sit back however they do it and then, you know, they ask you where you want the filler, what kind of look are you going for. I wanted to do the heart shape, um, the heart shape. So I got my injections right in here along there and then I did a little bit right in here right in there because my bottom lip is a little bit fuller than my top lip but I wanted my top lip to be more full so I did them around here and I did a little bit in here as well and then some right here and right here so kind of make it more pouty looking so you lay down you look, tell them what kind of um, look you're going for and then they inject you. So I thought it was going to be like one injection and they kind of just like, you know, the filler just fills up your lips. No. <laughs> if you do not like needles, I probably don't recommend it. Because <laughs> I kind of like don't like needles. As long as I don't look at it, if I close my eyes or look away, I'm okay. But like, I cannot get stabbed repeatedly like that. Like, no. I was not feeling it. <laughs> I actually got them done twice. The first time I went, I only did half a syringe because I didn't want to go too crazy because I didn't want to look crazy, you know. And plus, like, it was a lot for me to deal with all the needles that were going in me. Because, you know, they're sticking you a bunch of times. So, doing a little bit right here, right there, right here, right there, right here, right there, right here, right there. They're, like, poking you multiple times. <laughs> so, if you don't like needles, I really wouldn't recommend it, honestly, because it it's an experience you can feel it and you feel the needles going in you like 10 times and it's not that fun <laughs> so the first day I went I was getting my lashes done like I said and I was like you know what let's go ahead and do lip fillers so I just did a little bit in the top a very little bit in the bottom and then this is what they look like so then I was happy with it she was like you know let's let the swelling go down let me know what you think and if you want to do the other half of your syringe just come back in and we can do it so I went back home I let it um you know I let the swelling go down some and I was like you know what I want more <laughs> of course of course once you start this kind of shit you don't end okay I got my boobs done I got my lips filled okay <laughs> like 
So I was like, you know, what? I want to get more. So I went back the next day or maybe a couple days later. And then um, I got more in my top lip and more in my bottom lip. Just a tad bit. You feel the needles going in you for sure. And then they kind of just like poke it and then they massage it out a little bit. And then poke it, massage it out a little bit to like kind of like, you know, so it's not just kind of chunky looking. You want to like massage your lips. After you get them done, you want to massage your lips and kind of just you know spread it out some you don't want them to look bumpy because that's gross and who wants to have bumpy lips like no so you get your fillers in you massage it out and then bam you're looking like Kylie Jenner <laughs> so another question I get asked all the time is do you regret it do you love them I'm obsessed with my lips I feel like I did the perfect amount they're not too big but you can see a little bit more pouty in them you can see a little bit more full in them and I love them so much um, sometimes I have debate if I want to get like another half a syringe <laughs> but I don't need one I did a full syringe of Juvederm so one syringe and this is what my lips look like and I'll show you guys like I said the before and after So this is a short video. I just wanted to share this experience with you guys just in case if anyone out there is interested in getting lip fillers, just what to expect, what the process is like, and what the results are. You are swollen for a couple days, you know, like the very first day you look crazy you're super 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 swollen <laughs> but then after a couple of days when the swelling goes down you look amazing and you'll love them seriously you really will so that's it for me today guys thank you for tuning in and watching this video and i will see you in my next one bye